This row close sign has been a constant here on Lindbrook Street for five years. That's how long residents say it's taking Nassau County to fix a sewage pipe problem on this block. They say there's no end in sight and they're fed up. On Lindbergh Street, the only thing louder than the sound of heavy equipment ripping and paving the road is the outcry from neighbors. Our lives are completely turned upside down. Ann Kletcher says the problem started five years ago when a break was discovered in the sewage pipe beneath the street. She says instead of replacing the old pipe, Nassau County has done patchwork to try to fix the damage. <laughs> neighbors say the Band-Aid approach has resulted in on and off repair work for five years and counting. We have been not allowed to park in front of our houses. We've had the equipment in front of our houses. There's digging constantly every single day, Monday to Friday. Samantha Bassetta says she can't let her children play outside because the road work has caused several sinkholes on the block. It's dangerous for us and the kids constant construction. Judy Balestri says the constant digging is causing plumbing problems in her home. You don't have water pressure. I had to call the water company to make them come in to look at the water. And for Dave Jasinski, the seemingly never-ending sewer pipe repairs means he can't enjoy his house. It's been horrible. You know, you, you come home in the, in the fall where it's 65 degrees, you can't open your windows because of the dust. I'm sorry for the, you know, inconvenience. Nassau County Executive Bruce Blakeman says the problem with the sewage pipe was worse than anticipated. And I want to stress that it's important that we do it right rather than we do it quickly. We just want our road back, that's all. Now, residents say they would like to meet with the county executives to try to figure out a permanent solution to the sewage pipe problem. A spokesperson told News 12 that the county is working on communication with the residents and trying to make sure their questions are answered. In Massapequa Park, Virginia Huey, News 12, Long Island.